It's here in Kataku district where I found a man considered the most successful motor mechanic in Kataku district. Dick Echuban was born in 1979 in Mukura Mora district to Onyiro Silva and Atima Joyce, the seventh child in a family of eight children. He started in his primary education late. In Mora boys, then from there I went to secondary, I was in Ikume Wiggins. After his O level, Echuban could not continue with his education. He stayed at home and started to work to raise money to pay for a vocational education. Even sitting all level was difficult for me. I resorted to beating of bricks, uh, then I sold those bricks. After accumulating some money, he then joined a vocational institute where he took a course in mechanical engineering. That's when I joined to Benedictine Fathers, Tororo. His first employment was at the police mechanical garage in Naguru, where he also did his industry training. But he did not last there long. When those people said, uh, we don't need the civilians, we need the military. And by then, I, I was fearing something to do with a gun. And I said I shouldn't be a soldier. After quitting the police garage in 1999, he then returned to Kumi, where he worked okay. on a project run by an NGO, Irish Aid, where he was paid 50,000 shillings per week. He moved on to settle in Katakui, but at the beginning, life wasn't that easy. Then we opened something. It was the spares of motorcycles. And by then we had a few motorcycles. It was only for the government in, in Katakuya. Not like these days where you see so many. For Echuban, his resilience was nurtured during his early education where he was taught to be self-sufficient and own a business. It is this that encouraged him to start a motor repair workshop. That's why when I was uh, trained by this white, he told me, you are going to do a seller for a job. Don't think of going to look for a job. He started off with his business with a capital of two million shillings. However, through the course of his work, he has survived close to seven accidents. I have had more than six accidents. Even I'm still alive. Even as I talk, I have a material in the leg. I have the, all this hand was broken. That was in April 2009. And even here, I have a material in the leg. I'm actually, I call it a metal. At one point, Echuban ventured into owning a driving school in Katakui, but it failed to pick up because many couldn't afford it. You cannot train a person who does not eat anything. So at times, I could get those challenges. To him, patience and endurance are the binding agents to success. Currently, his aim is to see vocational school that he opened turn regional. <laughs> Dick Echuban is married to Rose Atualo. Together, they have four children. In fact, his wife is one of the first students that he taught mechanics. Uh, I started by leaving her in the shop. When I get some outside work, I could run. Then I started teaching her slowly, slowly, until she, she has picked well. And then when I had the, this terrible accident, I said, if I had died, then my family would have suffered. To Dick Echuban, although he may be the most successful mechanic in Katakui, his vision is to be the best in the region. Maurice Ochoa, NTV.